everyone. Welcome back to the show. Today is Thursday, January 21st, and it's a day four. Alongside Dave Donker, I'm Ellie Gabrino, and thanks for joining us. Hey, shout out to Mr. Panola and his creative writing students. Outstanding job for your work and open mic performance. Also, congratulations, congrats to Caroline LaValle for being accepted into a writing seminar that she will attend this summer in England. Kudos, what an awesome opportunity. Reminder, tomorrow, Friday, January 2nd, we will have a day five schedule. With respect to midterm review day, there is no morning show tomorrow. The morning show will return next Thursday, January 28th. If you need an announcement needed until then, please print and place in the yellow announcement folder in the main office for last block PA read. So weather reports indicate a potential powerful storm this Friday evening into Saturday that could bring heavy snow. This time of year with inclement weather, all drivers continue to proceed with extra caution while on the roadways. Apologies for any tech issues. We do our best to work through them. Okay, we'll get started. Attention juniors. At this time, there are no more parking spots available on campus. Bummer. <laughs> the junior parking lottery will be conducted at the start of the third marking period. If you would like to park on campus for the third marking period and there are no current and are not currently registered, please complete the online parking form. Additionally, please have your pay to play paid in full and possess a valid New Jersey's driver license prior to January 28th. Any questions, please see Mr. Chivas. Moving along, here are a few community announcements. Attention students who would like to volunteer. The Kinlaw Public Library has many opportunities coming up. Please stop by the library and talk to Mary for details. The Public Library is hosting several events. On, January, on Saturday, January 23rd, the Kinlaw Public Library is hosting a Come In, Calm Down, and Color event. The library will be holding the event from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Light music, refreshments, and art supplies will be available. I'll be there. This is an excellent opportunity to explore art in a relaxing atmosphere. Get out and about and support your community. The Kenilon Public Library is also, also hosting a Zentangle Art Night event. The Zentangle Art Night event is scheduled Wednesday, February 3rd from 7 to 8.30 p.m. All supplies will be available on site. Please visit www.kenilonlibrary.org or call 973-838-1321 for more information. Hey, this is an important fundraiser. Senior Samantha Steele has a bin set up near the main office for prom dress donations for the organization Catherine's Closet. Help support a great cause and make someone else's prom special. With any questions, please see Samantha Steele. Okay, now on to a few school announcements. Attention all, there is a creative writing showcase hosted by Mr. Panola and his creative writing students tonight in the auditorium from 7 to 9 p.m. Come out and support the showcase. The creative work by the students is absolutely fantastic. All are welcome. <laughs> the event will highlight student works in a relaxed, open mic style format. Moving along. We will be right back after this short message. to do well first you need to dress really nice <clears throat> thank you don't forget you need a team manager come on champ you got a man you got a boy huh? and you need a talent for the show oh wait i can Shh. save it for the show uh so what else you'll need swimwear really weird. Also, each Mr. Kinlon contestant needs a poster, a Mr. Kinlon video, we need six to eight contestants, and see Ms. Sapio for any other questions. So, uh, where do I sign up? It's not here. It's actually online.
that video and all who helped. Now, rumor has it, so don't quote me on this. We need at least two students to sign up. Deadline is tomorrow. Make it happen. There is a mandatory Mr. Kinlaw meeting Wednesday, January 27th at 10 a.m. in room 302. Yes, 10 a.m. It's after the last midterm that day. The show day is scheduled for Wednesday, March 30th. Let's not disappoint. Each participant will also need a manager to help him during the process. It can be male or female. The manager may attend the informational meeting as well. Please see Ms. Sapio with any questions. Okay, on to a few sports announcements. Hey, our next live stream event is next Wednesday, January 27th. KHS Wrestling against Butler High School. Go to livestream.com and search Kimelon High School. We're taking spring sports here. Talking spring sports here. Are the following meeting dates and times for spring sports preseason meeting? Spring sports preseason meeting schedule. Boys lacrosse today, January 1st, 2.30 in the new cafeteria. Girls lacrosse today, January 21st, 3.30 in the KHS library. Spring track today, January 1st. Boys lacrosse today, January 21st, 2.30 in the new cafeteria. <laughs> spring track today, January 21st, 2.30 in the old cafeteria. Hey everyone, the annual F KEA 5K run is approaching with a few months away, but it will be here before you know it. So mark your calendars now. Come out and run to support the Kinlon Education Association fundraiser 5K event on Sunday, April 17th, 2016. Sorry about that. For more information, please visit www.kea5k.org. Continue success to our winter sports coaches and teams. You can catch updates for activities, athletics, and news on Twitter accounts at KHS underscore sports or at the KHS or on the KHS district webpage. You can catch replays of the show on our KHS webpage, Colts news page, or YouTube. Just search for the Kinlon High School channel. Today's show was produced by William Klein. Our director today was Devin Anello. Our technical director was Michaela Bello. That's it. See you next Thursday. Have a great start to an early weekend. Be safe with the weather and good luck on your midterms. Peace.